Namaste to one and all. Welcome to my channel. Uh, I am uh, through this video. I am uh, conveying the gratitude towards Matthew K. Thomas sir, who is a founder of All India Educators Forum. The reason is that I became the resource person of AIF group. Uh, and uh, at the same time, I am uh, uh, telling you uh, the, this uh, uh, as a resource person, I got this post in 2009 from CBSC also. Today's my topic is Art Integrated Project or Art Integrated Learning. Here, uh, some of them asked me how the vegetation or the natural vegetation can be integrated with the uh, art. So I was going on thinking how it can be related. And another uh, thing is that uh, I have done about 14 videos, about 13 states, uh, art integrated forms of um, art forms of 13 states and one union that I have done. So some of the states I have not done. So uh, I made an effort to uh, explain some art and craft forms of uh, few of the states also here. The, uh, in order to uh, learn a particular concept, here I have taken the vegetation and uh, natural vegetation. In this vegetation, everything will include uh, that is a normal type of vegetation and a natural vegetation. And it can be learned by different art forms. Uh, and that is, it can be integrated with any Indian art form. And uh, they can be uh, represented in two-dimensional visual art or three-dimensional visual art, music and performing arts. Uh. So this topic that is uh, vegetation or natural vegetation. What is the meaning of natural? What is the meaning of natural vegetation? Natural vegetation means those plants which grow uh, naturally without human aid. That is natural vegetation. So I want to include all types of plants here and how it can be related to art. And uh, they should be uh, integrated according to the art integrated uh, learning project uh, the circular it says that it should be linked with the integrated with the any Indian art forms uh, and particularly one project should be integrated with the art forms of the paid state so the here uh, I have taken I told you the craft related uh, wood uh, craft related to wood uh, uh, fiber, reed, cane, etc. I have taken and few states also I have taken. Then another important thing I have and to tell you that uh, when you upload in the Kalasidu portal, that is in order to get the admit card or the 10th and 10th, uh, you know that uh, you have to upload the project. Uh, upload the project means that you have to make the specification, especially a particular number should be uh, 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 entered there, the number which is specified in the art integrated project circular. So that should also, so that those pages also I have included in this uh, uh, video. So uh, let us see uh, how the natural vegetation can be, how the natural vegetation can be integrated with the art. Here already I told you natural vegetation is the, a variety of plants that grow naturally on their own without human aid. And that we are taking into account and the vegetation we are taking into account. Simply I uh, went through that. Uh, yes. So when we say about art, we can see that the music, dance, art. Art means art and craft uh, and performing arts. These are the four major categories you have to focus on. Those who are the beginners, I am telling you that uh, how the art integrated project should be done. First standard to 12th standard art integrated learning, which is applicable to all standards. And uh, uh, 1 to 8th standard, it is an integrated project. That is, you have to uh, take one topic, one subject, that how it is related to that subject along with the other subjects. How one topic can be interrelated to other subjects, that is integrated projects. And that integrated projects should also have, uh, should be connected with the art forms of India. Any Indian art forms, each subject should have any Indian art forms. And at the same time, at least one subject should be integrated with the art forms of pair states. Then 9 and 10 is concerned, it is an enrichment activity. When it is an enrichment activity, it means suppose you are doing science. Science itself, you have to do the project. And you should integrate with any Indian art forms. But only the thing is that among the five subjects, one subject should be paired with the, uh, the uh, it should be integrated with the paired state. So, uh, pairing of the state, one, uh, one subject only, but it is enrichment, different, different projects will be there, but up to it, one project itself, it is an integrated project. 
and 11 and 12 it is a pedagogical tool as only that is art integrated learning is concerned how to uh, teach how to learn through the art integrated learning and uh, here I have uh, seen that uh, you can integrate uh, the vegetation that is you can have the pictures, painting, drawing that is two dimensional visual arts, uh, pictorial visual arts uh, that we talk about and uh, take photo is take photo of the premises of your house uh, or um, uh, where the plants grow themselves. Suppose it is natural plant, natural vegetation you, are, you want that type of where it is grown themselves. Suppose on the river banks, on the hilly areas, forest on the roadside uh, 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 that I am telling about the rural area in cities most often it may be uh, correct plants may be planted by the authority but other side you can see how the natural plants are grown that is you can take photographs of that uh, and collage making is different different photos you take different different paintings you make make a collage making then computer graphics specific number is also given more in detail the coming pages you will see what uh, how the number so the number you have to focus on and performing art performing art means moving uh, move, movement and dance movement and dance so you can uh, do that is uh, when we are uh, talking about uh, natural vegetation all plants will be included yes let me see the next slide yes when we say the natural vegetation there is tall trees huge trees shrubs uh, creepers uh, uh, grass, lichen, bamboo, uh, palm trees, uh, different varieties of the plants will be there. Suppose you are talking about, suppose you want to illustrate a forest, suppose a dense forest, equatorial forest. Ask the children to uh, uh, themselves act as trees or let them have the banners that they are representing this particular tree or they are representing creepers, they are representing shrubs uh, and uh, they are representing huge trees. Uh, like that, let them let them have the banners uh, through a visual uh, way they can perform it, uh, they can act, they can make dance or the, the dance with some movements they can do or they can make the lyrics. Suppose English is concerned, languages are concerned, whatever the languages, there we are learning to make sentences, that is narration. So there they can make uh, and they can narrate about the forest, what type of trees they grow, they see, what type of um, uh, creepers they see, uh, whether lichen is, is there. So like that, uh, the, uh, is, uh, the canopy, canopy, huge trees, tall trees, like that they can do. So uh, this way one topic can be conveyed to the children through different art forms, can be music that is lyric can be written that lyric can be uh, sung by the children and uh, the lyric means those who are fond of lyric those are fond of music let them do the music let those are fond of dance let them dance and like that those who are so creative in drawing sketching painting you know that according to that that is the cbc emphasizes that uh, if the what is the taste of the child according to the uh, taste uh, let the child learn from the experiential learning so here one subject is related one topic is related to one subject that subject is related to another subject and the children understanding that what they are learned is uh, uh, integrated to the real life situation that is a basic thing and th that they are learning this teaching learning activities they are learning through fun uh, through uh, some uh, activities what they like that is this experiential learning by fun they are doing by storytelling they are doing uh, so that is about the so this way uh, this can be illustrated and uh, next let us see what is given in our circular is uh, in this circular and as I told you, some numbers are very important. Yes, on the side you can see if uh, uh, you are implementing the suggestions given in the NCRT, that is, uh, uh, we can see that, uh, uh, that the NCRT, the position uh, paper, you can see how it is. Uh, uh, art education can be implemented. It, the, uh, this first one, it is about the school is concerned. Uh, and the last you can see, it is about the uh, visual arts uh, is given. Visual arts, that is 4.2. I am asking you to uh, focus on 4.1.1, 4.1.2. Anyway, these, these pages are not that much important for the uh, students are concerned. It is uh, all about the school. Majority of the work is concerned about the 
is cold and uh, yes you can go through that uh, but by anyway the next page um, you can focus more on most often the project will come uh, from this category Th that is why that is 4.2.1 so 4.2.1 is about the two dimensional pictorial activities. So 4.2.1.1. 1.1 is the study of visual resources as a means of creative expression. Then 4.2.1.2 that is a study of lines, strokes, colors, shades, tones, texts, etc. That is when we talk about the line strokes that come under the mathematics. And uh, is yes, that uh, 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 that way two dimension two dimension and uh, three dimensional shapes and forms so shapes are there colors are there so this can also be integrated with a different subject especially mathematics then 4.2.1.3 that is sketching from nature nature and surrounding so uh, when you are understanding about the two dimensional pictorial activities you understand that the common thing is 4.2 and then 4.2.1 then the next one is 1.1 or 1.2 1.3 like that so 4.2. Yes, let us see what what about the point 9 4.2.1.9 what about the 9 the what type of um, material you are using whether it is pencil or charcoal or watercolor crayon uh, crayons oil color poster color like that different types of uh, pen or the writing materials you can use according to that uh, that can be categorized into 4.2.1.9 and what type of uh, uh, the paper or the cloth where you are drawing it so most of the children used to draw on the desk most of that happens but uh, yes the only offline classes started is yes, this also used to happen so here you know as a project is concerned where you have to draw on a paper whether it is thick uh, paper whether it is a canvas whether it is a cloth cloth itself is a, whether the silky cloth or the cotton like that it goes smooth rough thick thin canvas hardboard uh, 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 symbol marking cloth uh, pasted on paper is on paper also you can paste uh, uh, paste the cloth like that uh, different ways it can be depicted what they are learning they, they can be depicted and uh, next comes 4.2.3 yes it is about the three dimensional 4.2.3 so there comes the 3.3 that is study of uh, uh, basic forms in clay what is the basic forms in clay then 4.2.3.2 so when it is 4.2.3 that is three dimensional that may be clay the study of various materials such as clay plaster paris uh, soft stone wood as yes, there comes as we had taken the natural vegetation as yes, you will study more about the natural vegetation in this uh, uh, in this uh, project uh, so what are they how the blocks things branches roots etc can be taken for the art integration and uh, metal scraps plastic sheets bamboo wire thread papers and cardboards vegetables and other throw away materials also can be used so here when we are associating the project with the vegetation uh, you can take all these things you can take even the vegetables you can take to make the uh, the shape of uh, different uh, different uh, things suppose uh, you are teaching elephant or teaching uh, a bird even the leaves uh, I, 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 I have seen that uh, the Pawan Sudhirji madam has done a different type of um, uh, art, uh, different different type of pictures with the help of uh, the leaves so this way uh, 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 it can be uh, integrated uh, and uh, other throw uh, uh, materials also can be used here so that about so I am uh, asking you just uh, uh, understand what category and what category you are doing this number should be uploaded in the Kalasidu portal and the teachers you can ask the children what you are doing go through this and uh, uh, that this comes in the art integrated project that uh, circular it comes it I think it's starting on 26 page on which you can see and ask the children to understand which category they are doing so it will be uh, easier for you and you can refer whether it is correct or wrong like that uh, it is will be an easy let them understand that what category they are doing or what are the other different possibilities they can do let them um, find it out then 
नेक्स्ट वन इज फोर पॉइंट टू पॉइंट थ्री पॉइंट थ्री दैट इज स्टडी ऑफ नैचुरल मैन मेड फॉर्म्स ह्यूमन फिगेस बर्ड्स एनिमल्स वेजिटेशन अदर ऑब्जेक्ट्स लाइक हाउस होल्ड आइटम्स बिल्डिंग्स और एज डिसेड बाय द स्टूडेंट्स इज दैट इज अंडर थ्री पॉइंट थ्री देन कम्स असाइनमेंट्स देयर आल्सो फोर पॉइंट टू पॉइंट फोर फोर कम्स असाइनमेंट्स the two or three dimensional subjective forms could include among others painting murals graphics clay modeling then wood carving soft stone uh, plaster paris block of brick constructions collage mobiles applique work can anyway, you understand that all these are two and three dimensional uh, subjective forms so these come under then puppetry puppetry will also come under this textile designing will come poster designing layout illustration layout illustration photography suppose you are doing a project sometimes you find that a very good layout they might have drawn but instead very less will be there so that is the layout also very important when a project is concerned so that way commander and uh, next one is that 4.2.5 there is correlating act art activities with the other schools so uh, that is uh, other school that is about the school activities are concerned let us see the next slide is the group activities also here go to the 4.2.7 that is theoretical understanding of art and culture theoretical understanding of art and culture is a short notes on important aspects of indian art and culture based on social science such writing may be based on reproduction of artwork printed in textbooks and uh, contribution made by any one uh, contemporary artist a contemporary artist their contribution also can be taken as a project so they are come under 4.2.7 and knowledge of terms uh, condo texture graphic form volume space tone print making like that it goes then comes performing arts performing arts music that is vocal that is it may be noted that this is suggestive all this list are suggestive only and so 4.3.1 that is theory knowledge of the terms uh, uh, that is sangeet nada then uh, swara shuddha like that it goes so vocal so those who are uh, taken the optional as uh, instruments they might have taken or music they might have taken for them it may be helpful for them now let us see how art forms are different states have integrated here uh, mizoram cane work basketry weaving bamboo and a craft nagaland wood and bamboo craft and basketry weaving tamil nadu also wood craft and tribura keen and bamboo and a craft so here you have to connect it with the different subjects is vegetation it is related to geography it is related to biology there is botany and what is the tall what is the height of the tree what is the uh, how how much uh, um, uh, how its uh, roots are grown what about its leaves all this connected to mathematics uh, connected to uh, botany connected to different subjects so here this way you have to connect that subject and what is the uh, uh, cane work they are doing what type of wood craft they are doing that also you can connect it to different subjects and uh, almost uh, you know that uh, whatever see around us uh, that is what are what type of uh, products what are the plant we can see that uh, carbon is existing in the plant so carbon is related to chemistry that way you uh, suppose you are uh, making an a bamboo craft and if that part, uh, working with a particular type of technique you are used uh, that technique is based on the physics so like that you Uh, connect it then uh, then comes the west bengal it is about the shala peta uh, craft it is a dried milky white spongy plant a, a particular variety of species it is and uh, it can be pressed and shaped into objects of art so that is a shala pit craft it is made up to, from a particular spongy type of plant so uh, understand what is a chemical uh, ke chemical compounds in that particular plant and also lacquer work it is a uh, using sap of the lacquer tree that is also related to chemistry and how much quantity will get from one plant how much quantity is related to mathematics then arunachal pradesh arunachal pradesh their cane and bamboo work basketry wood carving so that 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 also uh, we have seen what type of how the art forms are related art forms are related means how these uh, uh, things are uh, made then comes the nicobar and islands that is palm mats with the, the palm uh, we can make the mats uh, 
uh, it may be palm tree or leaves of the palm like that palm mats and wood craft then dadar and nagar haveli and daman and diu there is mat weaving and basketry mat weaving and basketry uh, it uh, says that uh, uh, is yes, one thing these two are where two union territories now both are one union territory then that is mat weaving and also puducherry also uh, they are wooden uh, serving mats are there anyway these three uh, union territories are uh, focusing on mats then goa it is a bamboo craft fiber craft jute macram craft so bamboo craft cane work then uh, fiber craft i told you already and uh, here macram craft jute macram craft macram craft means that uh, and the plant hangers are there plant can be hanged with a uh, plastic uh, or plastic thread or the other cotton thread thicker cotton thread can be used so here instead of that jute is used so that is a fiber the uh, jute is a fiber so that is how the um, uh, craft is related to vegetation then gujarat it is a bamboo work and embellished wooden craft can, is made up then comes uh, madhya pradesh dhari weaving dhari is a heavy cotton rug often in rectangular in shape it is associated with the season and uh, it and the bamboo work also there so rectangular is what is the shape i told you how it is uh, wearing take place when we are illustrating the color of the dari how it is made all this come under languages in true languages you can explain it you can illustrate it then maharashtra pidani sarees it originated in satpahana dynasty which originated from 2nd bc to 2nd ad so pidani that is in aurangabad that is a place in pidani pidani sarees in aurangabad aurangabad is, is famous for uh elora uh, ajanda elora caves uh, so it is related to history then mashu a blend of silk and cotton and uh, that is mashu it is a hand woven satin silk satin silk you know just silky smooth uh, surface is there at the same time some coils that is cotton it is a blend of cotton and silk uh, and uh, then uh, comes uh, again the um, himru himru is also the blend of cotton silk but it originated during the tughlaq period and uh, tughlaq period is related to the shifting of the, the capital from delhi that you know then comes uh, manipur manipur uh, it is a textile weaving which is famous for moirang pe that is a, which is woven secondly on both the longitudinal edges suppose you take a sari on the both edges or a shawl both the longitudinal edges it is a uh, edges of the fabric both longitudinal edges of the fabric oriented towards the uh, oriented towards the center of the cloth or cotton or silk uh, that is moirang pe then kauna mat kauna mat kauna is a grass which is an aquatic grass this aquatic grass that is this kauna most often grow uh, more in abundant in water it likes uh, water so that is uh, that is why it is called a aquatic grass there also we make a soft thick mat we can make different varieties different colored different type of things can be produced with the kauna uh, baskets can be made and so when in language is concerned whether it is hindi or malayalam or sanskrit or tamil or english you know that uh, you can illustrate about as yes, you come to our land come to maharashtra you can see you can shop by uh, the paitani sarees you come to manipur there is the moirang pe uh, clothes are available it is so uh, uh, beautiful so you can see that you can illustrate you can write uh, invitation card about it you can write uh, um, and that is uh, brochures you can write uh, so and you uh, and i think in the 10th standard there is a lesson in hindi there is some soldiers lesson is there you can ask the uh, soldiers you come uh, and uh, uh, you can come and uh, visit uh, uh, this type of Uh, and across what you have made or you can um, say that as we are going to give you you can write you can illustrate you can narrate all these things and uh, especially uh, uh, you can see that uh, all this how you write how you illustrate all this related to uh, languages 
so this way you can interrelate and the students are understanding that how one topic is related to different subjects and how different subjects are related to real life situation always one subject is related to another subject and that subject is related to uh, real life situations that is the importance of learning so the children are learning this through art integrated learning it is an experiential learning from their experience they are learning so they will never forget about it so in the art forms uh, what is uh, uh, explained in our circular that is dance forms are there face and festivals are there dress forms are there and before that art and craft is there dress forms is there food is there so if you illustrate about the dance forms or you are inviting a brochure as yes, you come and visit to our place and come and uh, visit our dance forms come and visit our face and festival as yes, you can write your uh, brochures and your you can write your invitation letter you can narrate about it you can pictureize it you can sketch it out so these are related to different art forms maybe uh, the two dimensional and three dimensional also is yes, you can take a even a tile you can take or a stand of a big uh, cake you know it may be having some stand or some wooden uh, some uh, surface you can select uh, which can be moved from one place to another place there you can see that uh, there with the plaster of paris or uh, with the paper mache you can make uh, forest you can make as yes, uh, huge trees tall trees uh, creepers uh, uh, and uh, grasses like in, in legends are uh, related to the hilly areas the snowy places it is related to so like that you can make an environment teachers can make an environment the uh, the students should make aware of this and uh, take the opportunity to learn this and make project and uh, they is the proof of this project should be kept in the school for one year and uh, the proof it should be kept under the custody of the school uh, that is uh, written in the circular and, and uh, only the numbers you have to specify while you are, uh, while you are uploading in the portal then coming to the next pages yes here see the examples of mashru then himru the mairangpi i told you both the edges uh the design is coming towards the center then kavana grass the kavana product and uh, this macram plant is really in their jute uh, macram plant uh, hanger has been made it is only plastic so this macram plant hanger can be made with the help of jute Uh, uh, and uh, different nodes will be there one node two nodes like that and a particular design will be there that is one of the crafts on they are using in the kavana uh, with the kavana reed uh, they are using this um, and uh, as i already when i uh, started this video i told you i i got the um, uh, identity card about the resource plus this uh, thing i told you those are not finished uh, the project try to do that and uh, i hope you will do definitely and uh, your children are doing that uh, mm -hmm. and wait for the uh, all the best uh, teachers and students and wait for the uh, second day examination all the best uh, thank you for your cooperation